was, and I decided to kill two birds with one stone. I actually spent the night in the health food store parking lot, so I'd be first in line the next day. And I got there. Matthew, the dairy guy who had known me pretty well, knew that if he had what I needed, I'd be happy. If he didn't, I'd be sad. And I'd start a search all over San Diego County. So he, I walked into the store. He gave me a thumbs up, grabbed my eight quarts of kefir. I walked out content for another two days, and I made a commitment. I was 20 years old. I said, I don't know how and I don't know when, but I'm going to have a hand in raising and growing the world's healthiest foods because I will never go without this again. I'm now going to be well and have a family, and they will never go without it, and I'm going to tell people about my testimony, and they will need it. And I made that commitment then 18 years ago, and today where I sit, I can look out the window and see cows, chickens, sheep, goats. Wow and all kinds of other uh, things, bees, et cetera, trees, orchards. I'm living the dream that God gave me. Now, for many people, they'd say, well, my dream is to own a yacht or a really big house and live in Florida. Yeah, I had that, but I came to Missouri for a bigger dream, and part of that is to raise and grow some of the world's healthiest foods. I love supplements, Ben. I formulated over 100 supplements. Many are bestsellers uh, worldwide. However, supplements are in addition to. I decided that I would help create uh, and, and really grow and raise from the ground up foods and beverages that stimulate the body to regenerate and be well. And I'm sitting amidst 4,000 acres right now with a state-of-the-art yet old-school processing center watching as we do everything from start to finish and deliver products that I believe can transform lives no matter what your age, no matter what your condition. And what's great is people can be skeptical about supplements, but when it comes to foods and beverages, the concerns, even the blinders seem to come off. And so we're doing things today that I have dreamed about over the last decades, and it's exciting, and we're really excited also, then to bring some of these products to your listeners and to the greater Longevity family. And I'm very excited as well. Let's talk dairy, uh, Jordan, because I think, it, is it fair to say that that is the, that's the core of your food philosophy, is the power of dairy? Is that a, is that a fair statement? It, it is, and growing up as a vegan, like my dad and my mom were in naturopathic school, and everything was was plant foods. In fact, I didn't have my first animal food, of course, after breastfeeding, till I was four and a half. And I literally avoided dairy like the plague. It was almond milk. It was soy milk. It was Mm. all these imitation milks. However, I realized in getting well that the right kind of dairy, which is very hard to find, actually is the most perfect food for humans no matter what age. And people will argue and say, well, we're the only species that eats dairy after we're weaned. Well, I could make an argument as I've seen Ten species of animals drink milk on my property and watch them come back to life. I can tell you that humans are the only species that Skypes and sends text messages. I don't think that's really a good analogy. We've been consuming dairy, some of the healthiest cultures in the world, for thousands of years. But you know what? In America, Ben, in Europe, and even in Australia, we consume the wrong kind. And I've spent the last five years creating the right kind, and we have stopped at nothing to do so. Now, when you say the right kind, you're referring to, I, I think you're referring to the, the protein fractions and the changes, the different kinds of protein fractions as they have to do with the types of cows that are producing them, correct? Absolutely. In fact, for, for years, I promoted goat's milk. I promoted sheep's milk. In fact, I was probably the largest promoter of those alternate dairy products. The problem is people don't like the taste of goat's milk. In fact, we were driving from Florida to Missouri, and yesterday my uh, third son, I gave him, he's six, I gave him some goat milk yogurt, and he barely took a bite of it. Uh, we ran out of Amasi, which is our culture dairy product. And I can tell you goat milk has its problems. They, you can't find it organic. They're not grass-fed. Sheep's milk's wonderful, but it's in short supply. And, again, you can't find it organic, typically not grass-fed. And so the cow is the perfect animal to produce milk. The problem is we used the wrong cow until we found the right cow. And what happened then is we looked back through history and realized that out of the ruminant animals, goats, sheep, cows, Cows, deer, etc. That cows are the only one that have two species, not breeds, but species: mm-hmm. yeah. the original cow and right. the modern cow that you see parachuting into stadiums in a Chick Fil A commercial. The modern cow has a protein that has been called the devil in the milk, and could be 13 times worse than gluten. But we bred that out of our herd. This is not genetic manipulation; it's selective breeding, and we produce dairy that people will say, Ben, that you've healed my relationship with dairy. They, they just love it. Now, we don't sell 
just straight up milk. I don't believe in skim milk. We sell a cultured dairy product called Amasi that I believe is 17 ways better than the yogurt and kefir you're getting from health food stores. I could fill a whole show with just its benefits, but more than anything, if you want to know where your food comes from, if you want to boost your digestion, support immune system health, build strong bones and get a wonderful source of CLA and omega-3s, our Amasi has been nourishing children and adults for the last nearly three years, and many cannot and will not live without it. And this is this is a dairy product that typically uh, that people who have dairy allergies or problems with dairy should have no problem with. Well, I can never say that unequivocally because there's people that are sensitive to water. But I believe that if you are going to tolerate a dairy product, that this is the one for you. And almost everyone who's consumed it has not only tolerated it, but it's made a big difference in their health. We've we've just heard amazing results from what it has done supporting skin health, brain health, helping, of course, with digestion. And really, there's a lot of kids now, especially those who drink a lot of juices, sodas, eat a lot of processed foods that are, are really in a failure to thrive situation and looking to get growth hormone injections, et cetera. This, this food nourishes you to the core. And I talked to a good friend of mine, Ben, who's a gastroenterologist, and we co-wrote several books together. Talked to him yesterday about doing some research uh, in collaboration. And he said, Jordan, that Amasi you have. And this guy can eat like you wouldn't believe. He eats a 48-ounce steak and uses the T-bone to floss with afterwards. I mean, he's just a machine, runs marathons, uh, triathlete. And he said, after drinking that Amasi, I can can barely eat dinner. It nourishes you to the core. It's amazing. That is awesome. So in other words, when you talk about food being medicine, you are really serious. This stuff is medicinal as well as as well as nutritional. Is that correct? I believe so. But you okay. Try it for yourself. I, de- I definitely want to hear about the Amasi and a couple other of your products. I also want to know how our listeners can get a hold of some of these products, Jordan. So hang tight. We've got one more segment to go. We're talking to Dr. Jordan Rubin. You are listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. We'll be back after this. Don't go away. You have all seen and heard about the elements of the periodic table. These elements are the building blocks of everything in the universe. You, my friends, are made from these elements. A shortage of any of these important trace elements can lead to disease. Go with the science and take the Lady Talk Health Challenge and get all 90 essential trace elements with a healthy start pack at LadyTalkLive.com or call 855-333-LADY. That's 855-333-5239. Research shows it's not just what you put in your body that counts, it's what you put on it as well. Why not use an all-natural, healthy, mineral-based makeup that actually benefits your skin? Once you experience the airiness and flawless coverage of Longevity Mineral Makeup, you will never use anything else. With Longevity, the perception of your complexion will be natural perfection. Animal-friendly mineral makeup at Mary Lou Health. That's M-A-R-I-L-U-Health.com. Or call 855-321-HEALTH. So we decided to upgrade the look of our home. You know, improve the curve appeal. We decided to add the look of stone to the exterior. We really like the stacked stone look. Yeah, but when I checked into the price, it was ridiculous. No way could we afford it. Then a friend told me about Genstone. G-E-N-S-T-O-N-E. Genstone comes in lightweight panels made of polyurethane. They've actually engineered the hassle out of installation. No mortar, no mesh. It was easy. Even I could do it. We just screwed the panels to the wall and it looks like stone. Stone. I mean, it really looks like stone. Yeah, from the box to the wall in minutes. We love the look of our home now. And Genstone is durable, comes with a 25-year warranty, and offers additional R-value for insulation. If you want the look of stone at a price you can afford, call Genstone. At 855-955-STONE. Trust me, you'll save money. And you'll love the look. 855-955-STONE. That's 855-955-7866. I will never forget the day my son Jeremy told me he hated me and slammed the door in my face. I'm behavioral therapist Janet Lehman. Behavior problems can turn the child you love and your life into a nightmare. That's why my husband James and I created the Total Transformation, the step-by-step program that shows you how to fix the worst behavior problems and get your child to respect and listen to you again. No matter what the behavior, defiance, backtalk, angry outbursts, disrespect, we can help you stop it. Now you can get the total transformation for free. All you need to do is get the program and let us know how it works for you. You can keep it forever for free. 
limited number of free programs available. Call now, 1-888-912-1595. 1-888-912-1595. That's 1-888-912-1595. 1-888-912-1595. If you need to say happy birthday, happy anniversary, thank you, or simply I'm thinking of you, ProFlowers.com is the key. ProFlowers has stunning bouquets, like the best-selling 100 blooms for $19.99. Plus, ProFlowers will include a glass vase for free. Sending someone a wonderful surprise of beautiful flowers sent fresh from the field is easy. Choose the bouquet you like, pick the delivery date, and each order is 100% guaranteed. Plus, all bouquets from Pro Flowers are guaranteed to last at least seven full days. Beautiful, fragrant flowers, picked fresh and sent to your loved one for lasting enjoyment. To get this incredible savings and send someone 100 gorgeous blooms with a free vase for $19.99, go to ProFlowers.com. Click the blue microphone in the top right corner and enter code PLOW. That's ProFlowers.com. Click the mic and enter code P-L-O-W. Not just an alternative to the mainstream media. We are the premier independent talk radio network. We are Jeeves. We are back on the bright side. I'm Pharmacist Ben. We're talking to Dr. Jordan Rubin. Jordan, so uh, Amasai is uh, almost like an iconic drink, uh, at least in the sense of the Bible. It's milk and honey, right? In essence. Well, it's certainly the milk part, and we have several flavors, including one that's milk and honey. But this really came, uh, the inspiration came from the Kenyan Maasai tribe. And if you read about them, Ah. they are one of the most successful, healthy, and militaristically dominating tribes in all of Africa. And they're milk drinkers. They are. The 90% of their diet is dairy, and they believe that, that God gave them the rights to all cattle. And so uh, let, me, let me just share something with you. Not only do they run fast and jump high, but their rite of passage when they turn 14, the males have to get circumcised at 14 wow. and then kill a lion with an <laughs> instrument that they make. Or their bare hands. I mean, that, I don't know about you, but that's uh, you know, bad, going, into, bad going into a freshman year of high school or your bar mitzvah or whatever it seems like a, a little easier to me. So, um, and, and they drink this amazing beverage. I learned about it in 2006. It comes from special cows, and it's a special process. And I committed eight years ago that I would bring it to America. It's not yogurt. It's not kefir. It is the one and only Amasi, or as you pronounced it, Amasai. And it really is so much more than a food. And now tell me about it. Why is it not kefir? Why is it not yogurt? It's fermented dairy, right? What's the difference? It is. Well, there's several reasons. First of all, let me just say that the cows are unique. They don't have that uh, offending protein, the A1 beta casein. And just so you know, either does mother's milk. So this is not introducing a foreign protein into the body like most cow's milk, 99.9% of it does. Number two, it's certified organic. Number three, it is 100% pasture consuming or we call green fed no grain no nothing we produce about 65 percent less milk per cow we raise the calf on mama cows we don't dehorn we don't vaccinate we don't Mm. uh, castrate bulls i mean you would just flip if you saw what even organic dairies are doing today but what makes amasi unique and not yogurt and kefir is the, the probiotic cultures very similar to what i used when i was in california these cultures are hearty you can actually take our dairy products and put them in hot soup and this powerful probiotic will still survive and more than that it contains dozens of probiotics the protein is intact it takes us 180 times longer to process this product we culture it for more than 20 hours and here's another crazy tidbit of info if you consume a cup set yogurt you know like out of the plastic cup right. those yogurts actually ferment in the cup which means you're putting warm or hot milk into plastic and as uh, many of us know that ain't good uh, there was uh, a little bit of country slang for you uh, we do it right we do it ourselves and there's nothing like it so you're doing this from cows to bottle on your farm but we're, we do it from soil to bottle. I mean, we literally have planted seeds for the right annual and perennial grasses. We have tried our best to steward over the soil. We call our 
process of farming, ecological regeneration. We are building topsoil. We are creating a breed of animals.